Do you have your real ID yet? In just about seven months time, you're going to need one if you don't have a passport to board a plane. While some folks are preparing to get one, people in northern Kentucky do not have a local office open yet to get one. Nine News reporter Raven Richard tells us one northern Kentucky woman's concern. Cold Spring woman I talked to wants to know when she'll be able to get her real ID locally instead of having to travel a long way to get one. I think it's going to spiral out of control in some states. I really do. Justine O'Brien is one of many in Northern Kentucky trying to get their real ID. She's been trying since 2019. I am extremely frustrated. If you don't have a passport, then you'll have to get a real ID by October 1st in order to board a plane. In January, only 27% of Americans got their real ID, according to TSA. There's going to be an uptick in foot traffic, so for folks to um, to anticipate uh, longer lines when they come in to get a real ID. The Kentucky Transportation Cabinet is leading the real ID effort. Right now, Northern Kentucky residents will have to drive to Frankfurt to get one. And that's a long drive, so I'd either have to take my husband with me or I would have to pay probably a couple hundred dollars to find a caregiver to come in and sit with him while I go down and take care of my ID. So what's being done? It hasn't been our plans to open an office in Florence, Kentucky to better serve the northern Kentucky region. There's no set location in Florence, but we do know they plan to open it in early summer. In the meantime, there are a lot of people who have passports or passport cards, mm -hmm. so they can continue to use that as a means to fly domestically. So for now, Northern Kentucky residents will either have to use their passport, drive a little ways to get that real ID, or wait until the summer for it to be closer to home. Raven Richard, WCPO 9 News.